the snake? That's gonna be interesting. Sako. Now I have mentioned that he has a character crisis, but he can stay true to Zelda sometimes. Every once in a while, you'll see him pull it out, and he'll claim to be a Zelda mate. And then every once in a while, he's gonna pull out like a Falco or something. He's gonna go crazy. He's gonna go Luigi. But let's see how this snake is from Nono. The snake's a rather technical character. And when everything goes right, it's beautiful. But the same can be said about Zelda, and right now everything's going right for her. 61 and rising. Sako, racking it up. Uh, a lot of grabs going on. I would say this is a button check, but it's looking like more of a assault. As Sako narrowly escapes uh, suicide, I lied. <laughs> He's pulled the feet from the clutches of victory, but the game's not over yet. He takes that for a stock, which is rightfully his. And it's back at 2 2. No, no, the nice, favorite spot guy to read, but it seems like he's playing with some lag here. The back here comes out, I'm not exactly anybody. The grab, Sako, versus the situation. He's an advantage. How long can he keep this going? The air dodge comes out, but it's not until those double rolls in the platform he really takes advantage in the up air. Snake. I won't say his recovery is exactly easy to get, but he's in the air. And you know he's in the air. And he knows he's in the air. So, he's got to stay safe out there. Sako kind of be allowed to run wild and then stay here. And no, no, the grab finally. Uh, I'm wondering what's happening. A lot of grabs. Every once in a while, he's getting the grab. Seems like he's doing some sort of grab challenge. Alright, Sako. Get in. Disrespect. Goodness gracious. Be nice to him. He's moving. Alright, we won our episode sort of come back. Going to return for another day. Welcome to have a good time here. Way back with the number 36. Oh! But we'll see if No No can make needed adjustments in game two. Right now, it's not looking very good. So I'm gonna be honest. It's, it's, it's extremely hard to bridge a gap this wide immediately. It's something you gotta do over the course of time. Hey, what's up, dude? Thanks. You gonna hop on the mic? Our first one. We're gonna have a co-commentator soon. But as I was saying, you have to fly that pretty sure over the course of time. Like in the first game, you gotta be studying them. You gotta be figuring out what they're doing. In the second game, you gotta continue. Alright, so I know about this ha uh, little habit here. <laughs> So, I know who, I know who Sako is, great friend of mine, is uh, with me, but uh, we also got this snake that I've never actually even played. Oh, hey, here, his name is Nono. Ooh! So, I, I played against, I played against Zelda um, with Snake before, and it looks like he was struggling just I don't know how he feels, but I don't know how he really feels about this matchup. Okay, okay. Looks like he's feeling a Um, well, I can't really say much, but... <laughs> but I'm assuming you didn't do that. Uh, nah. No, no, it's just going to Nah. I think it's just a little bit. Nasty. 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 I'm dying. I ain't dying. Come on. Oh, he SD'd. Oh, you hate to see it. <laughs> Alright, and that is the game. My amazing Zelda.